hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel cognitive connections i have some like channeled messages real fast i'm just gonna throw out one of the songs i've been getting is in case you didn't know i'm crazy about you and i'd be lying if i said that i could do this life without you and then another clip from the song i got is and even though i don't tell you all the time you've had my heart a long long time ago in case you didn't know okay so i'm getting a few storylines one is that you were blindfolded for a long time from someone that was juggling you and you got left out in the cold but you are coming out of being left in the cold and from that you became a wounded warrior whatever you've been working on your ships are coming in you're getting victory and you're getting a new beginning all this happened because you are a wounded warrior and you went through a lot of stuff and you went inside to heal now you were dealing with a very toxic person that you were constantly having to either defend yourself with or defend yourself from a group of people. I get that as well. Now, with these manifested dreams coming in and you being a wounded warrior, you're getting victory, justice for whatever the f you were put through and it took an extreme amount of strength and that's why you're getting this because you never gave up strength. Even if you fell down and were left out in the cold, you picked yourself back up, you had that strength and you are getting in this new beginning manifest the dreams justice and an equal give and take. I'm also getting that someone is going to be a star. You didn't just go inside to heal and people see you as very healing and angelic and beautiful and intuitive. I'm getting all these things, but people see you as a star. Like, you are going places, you are going to go somewhere. Like every time someone sees you, they see this extreme amount of potential. Even if you don't see it, you're like this glowing freaking healing star. That's who you are, okay? You're getting a handout from the divine, from all the hard work you've been doing. Whatever it is, don't stop. Keep being you, keep being your authentic self. And you are gonna be getting a message soon from a King of Pentacles. I do feel like this person has been coming in for a while, but this person is mature with their money. This person is a new person, okay? From this past person. But this person is financially stable, they're, they're well off and they're a King of Pentacles. But I'm also getting you are coming into this position of being a King of Pentacles and you will be celebrated for it. You you have the, oh, okay. The, someone is rushing in towards you. Someone is rushing in towards you. They could be an Aries or they could have Aries in their chart. But what I'm also getting from this is you are a strong manifester and you are highly protected. I keep getting highly protected over and over and over again. All right, you're getting your soulmate and or your twin flame, your true love is coming in. If you thought you were in a fake um, twin flame, 303 on the clock connection, your true person is coming in. Your true love, your true twin flame, your true higher level soulmate, this person's coming in and you are getting your wishes fulfilled with the 10 of cups. This person is rushing in. They are running towards you. This person I'm picking up, not only do they see you as the queen of wands and they remember you from past lives and get all these nostalgic feelings and you could make them feel like a kid again, but this person is like going to treat you right. And no matter what, just keep focusing on you. Three, three, three on the clock. Yeah, this person's rushing the in. They could, um, Ooh, you know what I'm getting also? This person from your past, this person from your past, they could also have Taurus in your chart or they could be dealing with a toxic Taurus. Now you walked away from the situation. This is the situation where you got left out in the cold and you walked away from. This person from the past is coming back in, but they're also seen as a page of pentacles. So this person that is a past person could also not be too well with their money. They're also coming out as a reverse queen of swords. So a very, um, you know, just like strategically manipulative and like they get a high off manipulating people and they get a high off being in control they could have a god complex i'm also getting that from this card or this taurus could have a god complex but they're having sleepless nights over you this person from your past because they're also the king of cups they could have been emotionally manipulative too but it came out forward it, it flipped up um, reverse for a reason for some but this person is extremely like having emotional feelings towards you and they're in their heart and headspace they're going through a hangman moment but also you could have pisces or be pisces in your chart have pisces in your chart and this person is going over going through continuous tower moments for being a player 
and probably not managing their money well. They're upset. They're crying over the past and they're being petty. Or this person's being petty. Or the people that this person, your person, is dealing with are very petty. This person seems to be surrounded by immature people that are petty. Also, you've been working on yourself really hard, but this petty person or the people that your person is dealing with, they're so bored over whatever they've invested love into, they want this with you. They are so bored and ungrateful for the things they have in their life right now. They see you as the star, they see you as everything and it's become a burden. They could pack their shit right now and leave. I'm getting that someone did pack their shit and dip. Yep, someone packed their shit and dip. I'm getting someone could also be um, an artist or like a magician, like actual magician. Um, I'm also getting musician. Yeah, and queen of cups. I'm gonna, yeah, you're coming out as this queen of cups, okay? You're, yes. You are coming out, you could have Sagittarius in your chart, or you're just this earth angel. You have this beautiful balance and equilibrium. People see you as extremely intuitive and healing and just this light. People see you as this bright, shining star and light. And there's multiple people I have that have either been doing black magic on you or manifesting or trying to put blocks in your destiny. People are trying to stop your destiny and fate. Yes, they have been doing either black magic and constantly I'm getting is throwing these attacks at you. But this could be because this person, your counterpart, has been coming in for a long time and they've been trying to constantly block this person, throwing things at them and you. Yeah, heartbreak. This person is so heartbroken over the past. I feel like this person could have also broke your heart. This is your counterpart though. The emperor and the empress just came out together. I need a thumbnail, guys. I don't know what to do for it, okay? Like, seriously, this is fucking beautiful. And this person's heartbroken over it. This person's heartbroken over it. But I also get that they're going to be taking action coming towards you. Like I said, this person could still be emotionally manipulative. And they could still be not well with their money. And they're still in a third party. That's facts. I get that. That's facts. Yes, that's facts. They are still in a third party, okay? If this person comes towards you, it's still deceitful. Still deceitful, okay? Okay, high priestess. There is a collaboration of people. They could be a Virgo. They could either be um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, because the fire sign. They could be Virgo, but there is a group of people working together to bring this high priestess down, to bring this higher level connection soulmate down and you went inside to heal from all this like i said cards clarify what i'm saying and the messages i get okay gosh i wish i uploaded this reading before the past two whatever okay but for real like fuck this people fuck these people um you're you're getting you're the nine of pentacles the wheel is on your side it was just 808 on the clock which is the one the one you are the one you are getting fame and fortune. You are moving up in life. You have the sun. You have the ten of pentacles. You have the ten of cups. You have all these amazing things coming for you. And that's because you never stopped working on yourself, my earth angels, okay? This person holds you very close to their heart. Like I said, they're still deceit. They are still in a third party. They could have this person pregnant. What I'm getting is somebody is pregnant from this counterpart of yours. And I need you to understand that they are gonna come towards you. It could be coming towards you so they could get financially stable and get money. They could see you as making a lot of money off of you or money with you. Sadly, this person is devastated and heartbroken of, over you, but there still is a ton of deceit. If this person comes towards you, it's because they're in love with you. They got someone else pregnant and they don't want to tell you that they're in a third party. And if they do come forward and tell you that this person is pregnant, they're heartbroken. They don't want to watch you get away. They see you moving up in life and they see you slowly. You crept the fuck away. They left you out in the cold, but you were like, you know what? 919 on the clock. I'm done. I'm not taking this. I am the motherfucking empress. I am a motherfucking earth angel. And guess what? I am balanced, I am beautiful, I am a star, I thrive, and I only want the best for people in life. So you will get rewarded. That's you. You are getting rewarded. You are getting justice for this shit, okay? <gasps> you are getting justice for this shit. Got it? Justice. Thank you for clarifying fucking everything I've been getting. Thank you, dear Lord. Literally, guys, like, 
that's why I come on here and I'll just start spewing shit because the cards will clarify. And right now I'm like tapped in. My energy's going, going, going. So if anyone does have a message right now, they want out, comment 1001 on the clock, mirrored numbers. I'm getting twin flame again. I'll pull a few cards real fast. My other video, my last one I just took, cut off early because this is the message that had to get out. This person's fucking toxic still, okay? And you could still be blindfolded. Like I said, this person does want this with you. They see you as their everything, but they're still stuck in devil energy. One, two, three. One, two, three on there. It was one, two, three right there, okay? Okay, clarifying shit. Left and right. Starseed, pull one of these real fast for you. What do they need to hear right now? What does my collective need the most to hear? If they could, before this video cuts off, what? What is it, you guys? This one too, these three. Okay. Karmic relationships. They're in a karmic relationship right now, okay? The person that they're with, that this person has been doing magic on your person. They have been putting illusions up, blindfolding them nonstop. They thought they were in love with this person. It was an illusion the whole time. This is a karmic relationship. They were brought into their life so this person could grow and be taught lessons, hopefully to not fall in these toxic patterns again, but that is up to your counterpart. They will never be blessed 11-11 on the clock. They will never get through life if they continue to be around toxic people, friendships, partners, parents, whatever it is, whoever the fuck is toxic in your life, Cut them out or you won't get rewarded. You won't be blessed, point blank, period. Sorry, not sorry, okay? I mean, it's up to you. You control your destiny. If you decide you wanna be a bad person and do a bunch of bad things, guess what? You're not gonna get rewarded. You listen to your intuition, one, two, three, you stay on the right path, guess what's gonna happen? Reward, 10 of pentacles, 10 of cups, abundance, happiness, love, full of life in your life like your life is just gonna be full of life and beauty and love and like fuck the karmatic relationship